Tasker's AI generator can now use time and app contexts in its profiles. So it can do a lot more stuff now. And it can also import from Tasker descriptions around the web. Let's check it out. OK, to start off, let's try out the time context. Let's make it do this. I want to listen to a voice saying the time every five minutes between 2 p.m. and 5 p.m. So what this should create is a profile with the time context where the time start is set to 2 p.m., the, the end is set to 5 p.m., and then the option to repeat it should be set to five minutes. Let's see if that works. OK, create a profile. The description seems OK. Let's try using it. I'll put in the generator project and then enable it. Yeah. OK, so the profile starts at 2 p.m. And then at 5 p.m. it ends. And then every five minutes it repeats. That seems good. And then what it does is says the time. So 15.39. Let's pretend it pa uh, five minutes have passed. And this seems to be correct. 15.39. Cool. So this worked. Let's give the app context a try then. For example, let's clear the history. And I want my screen to be horizontal whenever I'm in the Solid Explorer app. Now let's see what this does. The main idea here is I like to use Solid Explorer in landscape because it allows the uh, two tabs for, for uh, folders to show up. So whenever I'm in that app, I'd like to have my screen be horizontal, automatic, horizontal automatically. Let's see what the generator can do that. OK, can set it up. Let me just select the Explorer app so that it's sure it's getting the right app. Here it is. OK, it created a profile that will automatically force the screen to landscape when Solid Explorer is open. Let's see if it works. Seems OK here. I want to, oh, I need accessibility access because just to know which app is in the foreground. That's done. And let's put it in the generator project again and enable it. And now let's open Solid Explorer and see how that works. OK, that worked nicely. So now every time I open Solid Explorer, it goes into this position. And if I close it, it goes back to normal. So that worked perfectly. So this is the app context. Let's check out the profile that it created. It's a simply simple prof, uh, profile that when Solid Explorer is open, force rotation landscape. And then when it's not opened, rotation is off. Cool. Now, finally, I just wanted to show you how, how the AI generator can take a description. Like, for example, I have this one that I got randomly off the internet. And I can say, I want to create a task that uh, that's that does what this description says, and then I simply paste the description. And as you can see, this is the when you export something in Tasker as a description, you get something like this. But then it can be a bit cumbersome to take this and put it into Tasker yourself. So now the AI can help with that. 
It knows how to read this. It knows how to create tasker profiles and tasks. So hopefully it can translate that this into tasker's inner format and allow it to import it directly. Okay, it even tells you what it does. It will randomize a number, append the correct suffix, and then display the result in a pop-up message. Okay. Generate it. Let's not run it. I want to look at it first. And let's see. Okay, so seems correct. Let's see if it works. Today's, uh, it took four, so add it fourth. Cool. For eighth as well. 21st, so that's correct. 22nd, 16th. So after a few tests, this seemed to work correctly. So I'd simply got an, a description from the web, pasted it there, and it created the task directly. So these are a few of the new Tasker AI generator features that you can now use. And I hope you enjoyed it. Bye.